Welcome to Skylar Zoo. I'm Skylar, and today I want to introduce you to an underground expert, the European mole. Although you are not likely to see one, for they prefer to work when no one is around, the European mole can be found in most areas where the soil is deep enough to allow tunneling. Looking at the big picture, the European mole can be found almost all over Europe. These animals spend most of their lives underground, building their own tunnel systems. Preferring to stay in their burrows, they use their time adding to their systems. In a day, they can dig 20 to 30 meters of tunnel. That's about as long as three school buses. The tunnels aren't built to pass the time. The European mole uses its tunnels to collect food, like earthworms. They collect their food by digging in the soil, walking around and searching through the burrow system or going to the surface. Once they find the food, they will store it to then eat it later on. Moles are perfectly made for being underground. They are small, measuring about 10 to 15 centimeters long. They have short, sturdy forelegs that are turned outwards with wide claws, while their hind legs are much smaller. This helps them to dig and pull themselves through the tunnels. Their small eyes are hidden behind fur. Their ears are just small ridges, and they have a good sense of smell. All these traits allow them to dig without too much hassle. They even have specialized blood cells, which help them breathe the air in their tunnel that contain less oxygen than outside. Although most people believe that moles are blind, that is not true. They simply have poor vision. When the mole digs its tunnels, it doesn't see what will be there when it digs. It simply digs to extend their system and to hopefully find a good treat. Have you ever not known what was going to happen next? Like moving to a new place or having the rules change all at once? Did you ever get scared of doing something new? Were you ever asked to do something you had never done before? Although the mole might not know exactly what is coming next in the tunnel, it can rely on its senses to keep digging. When we don't know what is coming, we can trust God because He knows. The Bible tells us we can make our own plans, but the Lord gives the right answer. This means that even if you plan out everything, God will give you the right way to go. Hence, you can trust Him to guide you. And when you don't know what is coming next, remember to stop, think, and pray.